In this series of videos, we'll show you how to stay active while you're pregnant and how to get fit after your baby is born. The videos were produced by Health Promotion Switzerland. This video shows you how to return to your normal physical activities after giving birth. It's a good idea to watch the introductory video and the videos about perception and strengthening the pelvic floor muscles before you watch this video. Your body will then be better prepared for the physical activity. Make time for 20 to 30 minutes of moderate activity every day. This activity should leave you a little breathless. If you don't have time to do any physical activity one day, then increase the time you spend on it another day. It's important for your health that you get at least two and a half hours of moderate physical activity each week. If you haven't been active up to now, it's time to start doing some exercises. Six weeks after you've given birth, we recommend that you get a final checkup from your doctor or midwife. If you feel well after the checkup and are able to activate your pelvic floor muscles again, then we invite you to start with the following exercises. Increase your activity until you reach the recommended level of two and a half hours of moderate activity per week. If you have problems such as an unpleasant sensation of pressure in your vagina or even a prolapse, or you can't control your urine, wind or stool, then please talk to a healthcare professional. In addition to your pelvic floor, you should also pay attention to your abdominal muscles. Diastasis recti means that there is a gap between the left and right sides of your abdominal muscles. This is normal just after you've given birth, but over time the muscles should move back together again. Please contact a healthcare professional if your abdominal wall bulges outwards when you contract the muscles, or if you can feel or even see your abdominal wall sinking inwards. The recovery process is different in every woman, so it's not possible to give a general time period how long this recovery process will last. It's important for you to drink enough between and after the exercises preferably 300 to 500 milliliters of water or unsweetened tea. In this video, we'll show you how to do the exercises correctly and tell you what you need to pay attention to. You may feel more comfortable if you wear a supportive bra. The following exercises are done outdoors. Walk at a good pace with your child or children in the stroller for about 10 minutes. Breathe in and out deeply and make sure that your pelvis is not too far away from the stroller while you're pushing it. Maintain an upright posture while you walk. Find a sheltered place where you can do your exercises. Stop the video here and start it again when you've found a good place. Drink some water or unsweetened tea before you start the exercises. Stand behind the stroller with your legs hip-width apart. Breathe in and out gently. As you breathe in, bend your hips and knees and push the stroller slightly away from you. Keep your knees over your toes. Breathe out. Tighten your pelvic floor muscles at the same time and stand up. Pull the stroller back towards you while you stand up. As you breathe in, Release your pelvic floor muscles and bend your knees. As you breathe out, tighten your pelvic floor muscles and return to standing. As you breathe in, bend your knees. As you breathe out, tighten your pelvic floor muscles and return to standing. Repeat this exercise 10 times.
Put the brakes on the stroller. Stretch your arms straight up and walk around the stroller on your tiptoes five times. Breathe in and out deeply while doing this. You can stretch your arms upwards alternately. Take one step back from the stroller. Breathe in and out gently. As you breathe in, bend your knees and push your buttocks backwards. Make sure your knees are over your toes. At the same time, stretch your arms forwards and upwards, keeping them close to your ears. Your hands are on the handle of the stroller. Continue breathing in and out gently. As you breathe out, Contract your pelvic floor and lift your hands 10 centimeters upwards from the handle. As you breathe in, return your hands to the handle and release your pelvic floor muscles. Your back remains straight without moving. Only your arms move. Do 10 repeats. Stand up and shake out your arms and legs. Bend your knees again and repeat the arm lifts another 10 times. Drink some water or unsweetened tea. Go around to the front of the stroller and look at your child. Stand with your legs hip width apart and your back straight. Tighten your pelvic floor muscles. Breathe in and out gently. Rest your left hand lightly on the stroller for support. Raise your left leg straight backwards. At the same time, extend your right arm, keeping it close to your head. Look at your child. Make sure your neck is in a straight line with your back. Always come back to this starting position after each stretch. Now pull your right elbow under your belly towards your left knee. Breathe out while doing this and tighten your pelvic floor muscles. Keep your back straight. As you breathe in, extend your arm and your leg again and release your pelvic floor muscles. Repeat this movement 10 times and then take a short break.
Repeat this exercise 10 times more. Extend your left leg and your right arm. Make sure your posture is good and your neck is straight. Bring your knee and your elbow together under your belly while your back remains straight. Now change sides. Breathe in and out gently. Rest your right hand lightly on the stroller for support. Lift your right leg straight backwards. At the same time, extend your left arm, keeping it close to your head. Look at your child and make sure that your neck is in a straight line with your back. Return to this starting position after each stretch. Now pull your left elbow under your belly towards your right knee. Keep your back straight. Breathe out while doing this and tighten your pelvic floor muscles. As you breathe in, extend your arm and your leg again and release your pelvic floor muscles. Repeat this movement 10 times and then take a short break. Repeat this exercise 10 times more. Extend your right leg and your left arm. Make sure your posture is good and your neck is straight. Shake out your arms and legs. Drink some water or unsweetened tea.
Stand behind the stroller with your left side facing the stroller and your fingertips on the handle. Your feet are parallel to the handle. Breathe in and out gently. As you breathe out, tighten your pelvic floor and lift your right leg sideways as high as comfortable. Your toes should be pointing forwards. As you breathe in, bring your right leg back towards your left leg and release your pelvic floor muscles. Your upper body remains upright. Use the stroller as little as possible for support. Repeat this exercise 10 times. Now do the same exercise again, but this time extend your right arm upwards. As you breathe out, tighten your pelvic floor muscles and bring the hand to your right knee as it moves sideways. As you breathe in, release your pelvic floor muscles and return your arm to its starting position. Repeat the exercise 10 times. Now keep your right leg extended to the side and move your right foot like a windscreen wiper. Make sure that you remain upright and breathe in and out deeply. Count to 30 and then return the foot to the ground. Repeat the entire exercise standing with your other side facing the stroller. Only your fingertips should be in contact with the handle. Breathe in and out gently. As you breathe out, tighten your pelvic floor muscles and lift your left leg sideways as high as comfortable. Your toes should be pointing forwards. As you breathe in, bring your left leg back towards your right leg and release your pelvic floor muscles. Your upper body remains upright. Use the stroller as little as possible for support. Repeat this exercise 10 times. Now do the same exercise again, but this time extend your left arm upwards. As you breathe out, 
tighten your pelvic floor muscles and bring the hand to your left knee as it moves sideways. As you breathe in,